Hello. Here's a quick tutorial about our Nordic Viking landscape. I will demonstrate features of the pack and I will talk about how to use them easily. First of all, size of the pack is 1200 meters from each side of the landscape. So landscape is pretty much big and it's very customizable. We don't have a lot of level design so you can customize it as much as you want. We have some materials, some foolish types and we have two different maps. One is summer map and the second one is winter. So we, we have winter environment here. Okay, so I will start with landscape paintable materials. Under landscape tab, there's paint tab and uh, here are some paintable materials. So we can paint our landscape with those materials. First one is auto material. So this is the material uh, snow with gr ground mixed with ground and second one is ground material. This is pure ground. And we have stone, snow, grass and pavement materials. While painting we can adjust our tool strength here so it's kind of like brush opacity and we have some brush size. So we have our snow material here it has tessellation. We can paint grass then we can add our grass foolish types here we can paint it with the brush. So we have some medieval pavement materials. It's pretty much detailed as you see here. So you can create some pavement roads to the landscape. So here under meshes folder there are summer and winter meshes foliage. Those foliage meshes are the same but Mm, they have some different texture and material variations. I will use winter foliage for this map. So I want to paint some grass here. If you want to increase or decrease density, you can adjust it here with the paint density. You can add another foliage wherever you want. And you can adjust density or brush size here. There is also summer environment here. I would like to have a look at it. This is summer version of the environment. All paintable materials and foliage are working well in this one and this is very customizable. If you have any support questions you can send us support email or directly ask this in product page. Thanks for watching.